grew up in Athens. Um, I uh, studied civil engineering in the National Technical University of Athens and then I uh, continued uh, with master studies on applied mechanics and mathematics. I decided to uh, go further and uh, explore uh, this wonderful world of research by doing a thesis in the same, uh, in the same university. And then, um, then well, um, I had the, uh, the chance to work as a, an engineer in the restoration office of uh, Parthenon in Athens and also to be involved in uh, industrial projects related to the construction of masonry houses in Greece. This was uh, the context generally, but uh, after a point I decided that uh, the uh, world of research is something that I like a lot and I decided to apply for a position in the um, Ministry of uh, Development in France. It was a research position and um, I won the competition and I decided to come. It was in 2011 and I uh, joined the uh, Navier Laboratory, which is a joint um, research unit between IFSTAR, Ecole de Ponce SNRS. And um, this was actually my start uh, in France. Uh, now it is um, nine years since I came to France and I decided to make one more step. This time was towards uh, Nantes, not Paris. I left Paris and I came to, to Nantes to join Ecole Centrale de Nantes and uh, GEM Laboratory. The reasons were many. It has, they have to do with Ecole Centrale de Nantes, but they have to do also with Nantes, the city. As far as it concerns Ecole Centrale de Nantes, well, um, I realized quite fast that uh, there is a thriving, thriving academic environment that could help me, help me in answering many of the open questions of my, of my research. Um, uh, another reason is the reputation of the school and the presence of uh, many uh, scientists that have a worldwide reputation and they combine interdisciplinary skills that can be helpful for broadening um, my uh, research axes and methods that I'm using. Um, a catalyst for uh, taking the decision to come to uh, Central Nantes was the existence of a project that is called uh, Connect Alain, a program actually, um, that um, helped me to uh, take the decision and move to Nantes with the rest of uh, my group myself and my group, I mean the, my PhD students and my uh, postdoctoral collaborators. Um, a final factor that is important also for doing research is facilities. And the Ecole Centrale de Nantes combines a lot of facilities. For example, I would like to mention the uh, supercomputer um, and the support on high performance computing. And um, another aspect is the existence of large facilities in civil engineering and also the uh, existence of facilities that allow us to do uh, experiments in fast dynamics. Well, fast dynamics is quite important in my research because it is well oriented around uh, instabilities, dynamic instabilities. Okay, there are two axes in my research. The first one is on uh, earthquakes and the uh, possibility of controlling the earthquake phenomenon by slowing it down. And the second one has to do with the uh, dynamic behavior of uh, buildings and mainly of historical monuments, uh, but also of, on modern structures. But uh, when these are subjected to severe and extreme events like uh, earthquakes, explosions, tornadoes, and um, other phenomena that might be related to the context of uh, geopolitical context that we live today but also to climate change I'm talking about tornadoes and uh, winds and uh, heavy phenomena so regarding the uh, my axis research axis on controlling earthquakes this is funded by the uh, the European Research Council and we try there to explore the possibility of um, controlling the earthquake phenomenon by avoiding the earthquake instability of course, the applications can be numerous uh, and uh, because the earthquakes are disastrous. 
and uh, the impact in society I think is clear. But also there are uh, applications uh, in, the, um, in industry and I'm talking about the petroleum engineering, uh, CO2 sequestration and deep geothermal projects. I have been in Nantes for the first time in 2013 and I liked it very much. It's a very nice city and um, it is also well known for uh, Jules uh, Verne. But also Nantes uh, offers a very good quality of life. It was one of the uh, factors that uh, helped in the uh, decision-making process. It is also the capital of innovation, the European capital of innovation of 2019. And uh, it is fam famous also for the biscuits, the crepes and <laughs> well. Another important factor that uh, Nantes uh, has and uh, resonates with the fact that I am Greek and I grew up next to the sea is the sea and this was also another factor for making me uh, take this decision to uh, continue this journey into another city uh, in Nantes.